This is Anna. She's a happy 13-year-old who enjoys walking her dog and playing sport. Recently, Anna has been short of breath when running. Her father decides to speak to her doctor. The doctor notes Anna's symptoms and listens to her lungs. It sounds as though Anna could have asthma. The first test the doctor performs is a pheno test. Pheno stands for Fractional Exhaled Nitric Oxide and is the most convenient biomarker of airway inflammation. Healthy lungs produce a low amount of nitric oxide and pheno levels are minimal. But when airway inflammation is present, such as in asthma, interleukins IL-4 and IL-13 upregulate the production of nitric oxide and pheno levels are higher. A pheno level above 40 parts per billion, or PPB, means the patient is seven times more likely to have asthma. Pheno tests can be taken quickly and easily at the patient's appointment. The doctor can use the results immediately to help their treatment decisions. Today, the doctor is using the Niox Vero Pheno Analyzer. Niox Vero is the gold standard device in point of care pheno testing. Anna only needs to perform the test successfully once to give the doctor an accurate and reliable result. She inhales and then exhales through the handle for 10 seconds. The animation on the Niox Vero helps the user keep their breath steady. In around one minute, the test result appears. Anna's pheno value is 71 ppb. This pheno result suggests Anna does have asthma. The doctor then performs a spirometry test, providing additional evidence for the diagnosis. Anna is prescribed an inhaled corticosteroid and a bronchodilator, which should keep her asthma under control and allow her to live life without further symptoms. Anna's high pheno level gave the doctor confidence in her diagnosis and she was able to prescribe the correct treatment as quickly as possible. At her follow-up appointment, Anna had no symptoms and her pheno level was 19 ppb, a result consistent with a low level of airway inflammation. For the next few years, Anna felt well and regular checks showed her pheno level stayed low. Anna is now 25. She has recently experienced asthma exacerbations, so she mentions it to her doctor at her next asthma review. He asks Anna to repeat pheno testing with the Niox Vero analyzer. Anna's pheno result is 93 ppb. This is high and indicates Anna is at a greater risk of exacerbations than a patient whose airway inflammation is well controlled. The doctor suspects Anna could have poor inhaler technique. He shows her the correct way to use an inhaler and schedules a follow-up appointment. When Anna returns, she takes another pheno test. Her result should now be lower than the previous value of 93 ppb. The result is 67 ppb, which is moving in the right direction, but still high. Her ICS dose is increased and further checkups are scheduled. Anna is monitored at regular appointments and her pheno level first reduces to 41 ppb before stabilizing at around 22 ppb. This is great progress. Her pheno values suggest her airway inflammation is under control. After several checks with similar pheno results, the doctor decides to step down the dose of ICS. The doctor schedules regular pheno testing for Anna to ensure her condition is monitored and that her asthma remains under control. Through optimization of treatment and monitoring of adherence, pheno-guided asthma management is proven to help reduce exacerbations by up to 50%. Anna has not experienced any more exacerbations and has been able to go about her life as normal, confident her asthma is under control. With regular pheno monitoring, Anna's doctor is sure they're doing all they can to help prevent future exacerbations, leaving Anna free to enjoy life to the full, with no unscheduled visits to her doctor. Join the thousands of healthcare professionals who have already improved asthma care with Pheno by Niox.